What we do here is go back, 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 back. back. Um, today I've decided to do a tastings video. Um, I love watching these videos on YouTube and I love eating food and I love trying new things. I know this is kind of played out, played out like an eight track, <laughs> um, but I don't really care. I wanted to do one anyway. Um, so I went to the American grocery store in the city um, called 50 States, I think. Um, I saw this and I thought, what the hey? Um, Pumpkin Spice Cheerios kind of gave me the idea to get a bunch of fall snacks. Um, we call it autumn, not fall, so it's kind of weird for me to say that. So yeah, I got a bunch of pumpkin, pumpkin shit. Pumpkin shit. I wasn't much there, so I ended up getting just like a bunch of other snacks as well. Um, yeah, I'm, I'm, I don't actually get, not really sure why everything's pumpkin flavored, like for this season. Um, it's kind of weird. I do like pumpkin. I like pumpkin and like pumpkin soup, roast vegetables, you know, the savory type things. That's cool. Let's start. Um, so first off, I'm going to try this because it is the morning where I am right now. It's like 9 a.m. Yeah, it's like 9.30 at the moment. So let's start with some cereal. Quick question. Do you put the milk in first or after? like with cereal because I can't eat my cereal if the milk's already in there because I feel like it's old milk that's not right um anyway here we go just smells like cinnamon 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 something I don't know but okay I'll take a big bite I was going to get some major pumpkin taste from that. I could not taste no pumpkin. I could taste cinnamon. Maybe a little bit of nutmeg. Um, on the back it says, We believe that real food tastes better. That's why pumpkin spice cheerios is made from real pumpkin puree and a delicious blend of cinnamon, nutmeg and clove. I, I could taste the spices, but not the pumpkin. It's just average. It's average. I don't know if I would ever buy this. because I could put some cinnamon and brown sugar in my wheat beaks and get the same effect. Um, so if I had to rate that out of, I don't know, what do people rate things out of five? I'd say maybe two and a half, it was average. It wasn't disgusting, I just would never buy it again. Not my style. Um, what's next? Oh, I saw this. <clears throat> Jello, 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 Jello. We have um, aeroplane jelly. Aeroplane jelly is a shit, has best jelly, love it. Um, jello, I'm not sure how you could get a pudding spice flavoured jello. When I was there, I thought this was actually jelly, um, and then I came home and it said instant pudding and pie filling. So, I don't know. I think, I don't know. I've made a pumpkin pie before. This is cheating. Cheating. This isn't jelly, it's not pie filling, it's, I don't know, maybe pudding. All you had to do was add milk and then whisk it. It was really weird. You didn't have to refrigerate it or anything. So this is that. This is what it looked like. Um, it kind of looks like baby poo forward slash baby food. Depends how you look at it. Glass half empty, glass half full. I don't know. Kind of looks like short or two. I'm just not sure how I feel about this. It smells like the cereal. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Gonna take a big bite of this. That was weird. I don't know if I liked that. That was really weird. I should have water around here somewhere far out. That was, um, unpleasant I don't like the texture and I don't like I don't like how it tastes it tastes like the cereal mushed up with a little bit of cardboard 
Oh, mm -mm. didn't like that. Next up, we have Oreos. Um, I'm not sure why you would do this to an Oreo. Why would you make it pumpkin spice? This is ridiculous. Um, I just, I don't understand why you put pumpkin in everything. It's really confusing me. Um, but whatever. I like original. In Australia, we have like original chocolate. I'm pretty sure we have strawberry sometimes. Um, but on the back, there's like a mint flavor. That would be, that would be it. Um, so here we go. You guys get like a cool tray as well. This is awesome. So it doesn't like get jumbled and shit. Um, like here, we just get it in a packet. So if they break, they break. You know, you just gotta move on with life. Um, smells like, smells like brown sugar. Mm. First you twist it, then you lick it, and then you dunk it. You know what a dunk is. Um, so the cream tastes like normal cream with a little bit of flavouring, but I'm not sure what that's meant to be. I'm assuming it's meant to be pumpkin because it's orange. But... I'm not too sure how I feel about that. It doesn't taste like pumpkin. It doesn't taste like cinnamon either. It just tastes like sugar. I don't think I would eat that ever again. Did I rate the pudding? The pudding was like a two out of five. That was below average. No, I'm gonna give the pudding one out of five. And then the cookies, two out of five. Cause I don't think I could ever eat another one of those. That was kind of gross. They just destroyed a, an Oreo. Oreos are so good. That was shit. That was so fucked up. Ugh. Okay. Ugh. Next up, we have Hershey's. I love Hershey's. I like Hershey's Cool and Cream, not the original. This is um a candy corn cream with candy bits, naturally and artificially flavored. That's so wild to me that they'll write that's artificially flavored. In a, this wouldn't even sell in Australia. If this was set on a packet, everyone would be like, What the fuck? Fucking not teach me, baby. Fuck that shit. Pass me my cigarette. That's bullshit. Anyway, I'm going to try this artificially flavoured chocolate. So it's white chocolate with candy corn in that. I'm not sure what candy corn is, so I'm not sure what to expect with this. But I do like chocolate. I don't like that. I was... It's kind of gross. Kind of tastes like um, just like cheap white chocolate. Weird. I don't know. It's like those hard lollies you get from the reject store. I don't know. It's just shit. That's. I don't like that. That's two out of five. Fuck you, Hershey's. So the rest of the stuff that I'm gonna do now are things that are not full, because I couldn't find all like pumpkin shit. That was all the pumpkin stuff that was there. Thank goodness for that, because I just realised I don't like pink, pop, little, pop, 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 pop. um, as I don't like pumpkin spice things. That shit is weird. If why wouldn't they just leave it as cinnamon spice? Cinnamon spice is legit. That shit is a one. This is bullshit. Look at my ass. Um, next up we have a chocolate bar called Three Musketeers, whipped up fluffy chocolate on chocolate taste. Kind of sounds like a Milky Way to me. So I'm not really excited for this. Um, but I'll give it a go anyway. Man, I'm feeling kind of sick, eh? This is it's a little too early to eat this shit. It smells like chocolate. Huh. Oh, right, Milky Way. Cool. Mm. Milky Way tastes better, though. This is kind of like cheap chocolate with the fluffy shit on the inside. I give three musketeers. Two and a half out of ten. Which is average. Next up, we've got Twizzlers. Um, there was the original long ones that were there. But my sister chose this one. because She said it sounds interesting. With um, strawberry filling. So Twizzlers Bites. Um, filled, fruity twists. Strawberry, artificially flavoured. Again, with artificially flavoured. Why would you... 
I just don't get it. Like, thanks for the heads up, but I'm not gonna buy these. But it's low fat as well. That doesn't really mean anything. If I'm about to buy some candy, I don't really care if it's low fat or not. I don't really care about the life. So that's what it looks like. It's like a, well, it's like a pastel red. It's got like some jelly filling inside. Mm. I like this. I like this. I'm gonna eat the whole pack up. These taste like those red licorices, the twisty ones you can get from the deli. When I was a kid, I used to get them for like five cents or something. Or you get like five bucks. I don't know, they were really cheap back in the day. They look a lot though. Mm -hmm. oh my God, so oh my God. Next up, I got some crisps. Crisps, 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 crisps. Okay, next up we have some combos. Oops, okay. So let's chuck that away. Mm, cheddar trees. <coughs> cheddar cheese cracker. Fake snacks. <clears throat> what does it say? <clears throat> Let me clear my throat. Anywho, so what does it say? It's something about NASCAR. An official partner of NASCAR is registered trademark national. NASCAR is like your version of Bathurst. They're Bathurst, so you just like drive in a circle. Shit's so boring. It smells cheesy. It smells like those um those cheese crackers. What are they called? Cheddars? I think they're called cheddars. Mm-mm, these are cool. These remind me of, um, like a snack you'd put in a lunchbox for a kid. They're cool, I like them. So I get a three out of five. Now last but not least, We got some Cheetos, some flame and hot crunchy best sold and duo duo made with real cheese export. What's the serving? Count 21 Cheetos brand, flame and hot brand flavor, crunchy taste for a taste that's bold. It's just the right amount whether you're young or old. Are so red that is so wild Australia would never sell anything this red unless it's a tomato this is crazy how is this so red they look like twisties we have twisties like these cheese snacks that look like this oh my god these are I like these they taste like burger rings but spicy spicy I like spicy food, so this isn't really spicy for me. But it tastes like we have these things called burger rings. But this is like, ooh. Oh, I like these. I fucks with these heavy, man. These are, yeah. That is all the food for me to try today from the fall um, snacks. Tries. Australian tried full snacks video. Um, yeah, I hope you enjoyed because I know I certainly did enjoy eating all those snacks, but even though I'm feeling a little bit sick right now. Um, yeah, don't know how I'm supposed to continue my day now. Anywho, um, if you want to see more of these food tasting videos, let me know. If you don't want me to do any more of these food tasting videos, let me know. Oh. Thanks for watching guys, um, I'll catch you in my next video.